I decided to try drop shotting nymphs at Quail Lake yesterday because I hadn't been out there since last May and I thought maybe the fish might have missed me. I got there around sunrise and didn't see another fisherman for several hours. There were plenty of dog walkers, joggers, and some firemen were practicing rescuing each other from a hole in the ice. But no fishermen until probably afternoon. The bite is better in the early morning. I suspect the fish are less wary in lower light conditions. I had caught over 40 fish by 10 o'clock and maybe only a dozen fish after that time. It was 20 degrees when I got there, but even that seemed pleasant compared to the negative temperatures we had just a few days ago. I also had on plenty of layers and pocket warmers. By 11 o'clock I was shedding layers. It was only about eight feet deep at the end of the dock and the fish were mostly close to the bottom, but I did catch a few fish just under the ice, which was only a couple of inches thick near the dock. Caught a couple on the drop, some just sitting still, but most bites came on a slow lift after a few shakes. I was using size 12 nymphs on a four pound fluorocarbon leader with a 1 16th ounce drop shot sinker. Never even used my second rod. I dropped it in a hole to my left just to keep any fishermen from fishing too close. I didn't get a lot of video with my new camera. Apparently, even though I deleted videos from my memory card on my laptop, if you don't format the card on your camera before using it again, you don't have available space. Lesson learned. Had to shoot most of this video with my phone. As I was getting ready to leave, a young boy, Nathan, and his mother, Michelle, came out onto the dock. They lived nearby and were just out for a walk. Nathan seemed very interested in fishing, but the bite had completely died down by then. Luckily, I always keep waxworms in my pack, so I tipped the nymphs with waxies. It worked. He ended up catching four fish and missing several others. Nothing big, but I have a feeling there are gonna be some big fish in his future. He's hooked. His mother had a difficult time getting him to leave. I told her it's only gonna get worse. I only fished for another 30 minutes after they left. There was a 20 inch fish under that dock that I was hoping would get hungry before I did. He didn't. I'll be back. Hope to see you at one of the lakes and good luck out there.